This is our tandem, built in 1978. I've owned it for around 15 years, maybe more. And the front is like a regular bike with two bars linking up to the back of another bike. And the cranks are connected together on the left side with a left side chain ring. So they're always in sync with each other. The pedals hit the floor occasionally because the bottom brackets are quite low. And then there's a very long chain to connect the front chain ring to the back wheel. And a very long back brake cable as well. The brakes are the cyclocross style for extra power. And the rear wheel is like a BMX style axle, not quick release, but extra strength considering the weight of two riders on that wheel axle. The handlebars at the back are attached to the seat post at the front with this stem. And the front is just like a regular bike with the cyclocross brakes. I've included a cyclocross tyre because it's winter on the dirt track. And that is the basic setup of the tandem. Triple chain ring at the front because we're fairly slow uphill and fast down the hill and a wide range of gears at the back. And that's it. What's good is some days Tom will go to school with his neighbour in the car and then at lunchtime I can ride the tandem by myself, don't need to carry a second bike. And I can pick up Tom. There's a lot of flexibility whether there's one or two of us. And it saves me using my car. Yesterday I didn't have to move my car once. Rather than having to do three or four trips in and out of town.